Hey guys, d here for another episode of Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. We beat... We, we completely beat off World 1. Now we got World 2. I don't know what this world is called at all. I don't know if they have... I mean, I think they have names. What is this one called? Autumn Heights. There we go. I guess I could have che checked that. Sounds like a rich white girl's name. Anyway, we're at World 2, Level 2-1, Windmill Hills. We're going to bring in our inventory another squawks because i don't really feel like i did a good enough job at showing squawks off or maybe it just didn't register very well so i'm gonna try it again and see if squawks can actually help us but you know what helped me if you guys are enjoying these videos liking commenting and subscribing watching oodles of noodles of videos all at once if you can enjoying the architecture and the music kind of has a bit of a i don't know i guess i would say maybe Central European kind of vibe to it, Northern European, wherever the Netherlands is, Germany. Those are places, right? Okay. So thankfully, Squawks is losing its mind at the fact that there's probably a puzzle piece at the end of this mini game. But also, part of the mini games, and it's the frustrating part, is that you actually have to do them correctly because if you don't, let's see what Squawks thinks. Oh my goodness. Squawks is all about that. Getting off Squawks Rocks, that's for sure. My goodness. This video in particular is dedicated to a former Let's Player from the old Netherlands. You're watching this. Thinking of you, buddy. So anyway, let's keep going. We'll see if having Squawks around pays any dividends. I don't quite remember if this is one of those levels that's got like a tricky amount of puzzle pieces. I feel like it has a lot of them. I think it has nine, which is kind of annoying. But I don't remember any of them being too tricky, I hope. Because it's tricky to rock a rhyme. To rock a rhyme. That's right. Oh, and we're dead. Oh, we're not. We're, no, we're dead. We almost didn't die, and then we did die. That is quality. Anyway, all the pieces we've gone so far, thankfully, are retained. So we don't have to worry about that. We can just grab Dixie and be on our way. Yeah, that was a uh, little scary. Yeah, it's nice that the game does give you a heads up on which one you have grabbed with the kind of translucent letters and puzzle pieces. I really appreciate that. Makes me happy. Because you know that these levels are not being completed in one shot. No, sorry. I mean, if I just wanted to play through these, and I didn't care about getting the awesome art and music and dioramas and whatever else you get, then I guess I would just power through. But I don't want to do a disservice to Donkey Kong Country. It's one of my favorite games, and I think it deserves the full course treatment. All right, so I think that this might be a puzzle piece because Squawks is having a good old time. First, we're going to kill this Whistle Pig. I'd say Whistle Pig is a beaver, so I don't know why I said that. It is. That's four out of nine. We're feeling good. There's a lot of moments when you'll be playing through this where you'll be thinking like, yeah, that's definitely a puzzle piece. It's not. The game is very subversive and tricking you into thinking that these little windmill moments are like, oh yeah, that's definitely gonna be a puzzle piece. And then it's not, it's bananas. Or, you know, a banana coin, which I guess a banana coin is better than bananas, but, you know, in general, nothing to write home about. Dear mom and dad, today I played Donkey Kong Country and I got a bunch of bananas. P.S. Please send a P.S. file. The end. Do you ever end letters with the end? I hope you don't, because that would be crazy. Oh, come on back now. Mr. Mouse? Yes. That life was very kind to just wait there for us. I want to call that a pity life. Usually when I play through this, I go for the banana coin. But every so often, when I'm just, you know, not being very good at the game, I'll wind up nabbing that heart. It always just depends. You might be thinking, hey, there's possibly a puzzle piece out of this. Well, no, I brought squawks along to show you that that is not what we're getting. Well, first off, I have to get all the bananas before the time limit runs out. There's a nice little Easter egg, though, with the with the sound of that you got a... What am I trying to say right here? It's the, the bonus area sound that you get from Donkey Kong Country Just. So that's really nice. Yeah, I guess... I guess I don't need there to be a ton of puzzle pieces. 
I wonder if Squawks thinks there's a puzzle piece in this big sack. What do you think, buddy? But yeah, the downside, though, is that you'll wind up having to give up Dixie, I think. Oh, wait, maybe not. I'm gonna stick with Dixie, because she's great, and she's my favorite of the companions. I like Diddy, too, but... Oops. <laughs> is that what you're supposed to do? I feel like that's not what the game wanted me to do. Also, that pig... I feel like that respawned pretty quick. But before we go back and collect the helmeted penguin, we are going to grab that puzzle piece. Oh, oh, heck off. All right, get out of here. That stupid pig comes back so fast. What, Dixie, just let me have it. All right, there we go. A little bit of space in between the two, so they're not gonna friendly fire on accident. All right, can we just, can we please just have a, a nice family-friendly moment? Collecting this puzzle piece, thank you. It's a nice amount of puzzle pieces, too. Oh, yeah. We're feeling good. We're doing all right. The first few levels of this world are pretty fun. They're very cute, very silly. I love the aesthetic. I love, I love the music. I love the introduction of kind of different enemies. But I won't, I won't be saying that forever, trust me. Like, there are, there are some levels in this world that are just absolutely brutal. I can already think of one right now. If you guys didn't like minecart levels, well, do I have a treat? I mean, I don't have a treat, but they do. Retro Studios has a treat for you. And you, you're going to take it and you're going to like it. And if you don't like it, well, that's just too bad. You got to be careful here, though. It's very tempting to jump in that barrel. But why jump in that barrel when I mean, you can jump in this barrel? Get yourself a barrel blast and minigame. I feel like a carny when I always say that. Step on up to the barrel blast and minigame. I don't know why my carny voice is something from the south. I'm pretty sure carnies exist literally everywhere. But maybe they're just better at it. Maybe that's it. We should celebrate the best of the best. The crop of the cream, you know what I'm saying? So there we go. Two puzzle pieces left. We're doing okay. Oof, almost messed that up. Great. So we're going to grab this banana coin. And slide down this zip line. This is one that we don't control, thankfully. The zip line shrine. I don't know if all these bananas result in a puzzle piece. I hope not. But I am missing them left and right. Not my finest moment. Yeah, this level loves all these stupid eroding platforms. But it gives you a ton of lives. So if you're like me, and you're really bad at this game, then you have nothing to worry about. There'll be tons of lives to bail you out. Come here, Benangel. Thank you. That's wonderful. Okay, so make sure you get saved by the bell here. You gotta ring them all. Break off that little subsection of the log. I don't know how... I don't really understand the physics of that. But I guess I shouldn't be trying to figure out physics of a Donkey Kong game. Is a recipe for disaster. I like how we don't ever say the opposite of that. You know, recipe for disaster. That's a recipe for su Oh, I guess we do say recipe for success. I'm stupid. <laughs> I deserve that. We say both. All right, I'm a ding dong. I totally forgot about how words work. Oh, no, I don't have Dixie. This is going to be oh, insurmountable. No, it's fine. I say that and then it's like, you know, 10 takes later. I'm like, guys, it's fine. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Sometimes I get stuck and I hit the wrong button, which is kind of annoying. Kind of annoying, super annoying. The most annoying. And this doesn't even have all the stupid platforms on it. And one of them is going to go away, so it's like a 50-50 shot, so you got to be mindful of where you're hopping and bopping. But thankfully, this first level, it does have nine, but it's not too bad. So don't be too upset about it. Maybe it'll take you a couple tries, like yours truly. That's okay, no harm in that. But you gotta be quick here on the G. However, you, you're gonna wanna make, you're gonna wanna, wanna wait a minute. Wait a minute now, because that puzzle piece is hiding. So that's all of them, I believe, is that correct? It is, we did it. All right, so I'm just gonna take whatever I can get. I'm also gonna try not to die here. Take what he can get, and then he gets the, then he gets the coin like he wasn't trying. I actually didn't think I was going to get that. That was a leap of faith. Complete fear on my end. Yes! So we have unlocked the image. I do believe the next level is a little bit kinder in the amount of puzzle pieces we need. 
but really the the main thing we're trying to get isn't just the puzzle pieces it's more of the dk letters the k-o-n-g that's what unlocks all the levels which i mean you know getting the artwork is nice but my uh my main quest here is to absolutely get all the levels you can't technically 100% the game without the, uh... You can't 100% the game, I think, without getting all the, the puzzle pieces and stuff, but I could be wrong. But what I'm not wrong about is that we get to use my boy, Harin. He is... a lot smaller in this game, but still very useful. Immune to spikes, which I love. He can charge around. You're going to have to be careful, though, especially if you're playing this level with a friend. Only one of you controls Rambi at a time, but you can definitely you can definitely control who dies. So that's something to be mindful of. You might wind up alternating who does what. So don't break those Rambi blocks yet for two reasons. One, because you want to make sure that you get that letter. Two, because we got a bonus. We got a bouncy bonus on this one. Do we love the bouncy bonuses, ladies and gentlemen? I don't, because I'm always just afraid I'm going to fall. That's a very legitimate fear. Basically, as serious as, like, my fear of bears and bees. That's not meant to be, like, a joke on the letter B. I, I'm legitimately afraid of both of those things. So, uh, lay off, maybe? Okay. So we got to hurry up here. Ooh, at the last second. Slam dunk on that puzzle piece. At the moment. Nice. So, oh, this one only has, only has seven. That's good. Do we love seven, ladies and gentlemen? I was hoping I don't mess this up. Cause I'm just thinking to myself, like, the one downside to this game is that when you complete the level, it locks you in, like it auto saves it. So you basically just have to be like, accept your fate, I guess. I mean, you could replay it, but then you won't see the... Ooh, this one, I remember, this is time. This is a puzzle piece, I think. Come back. Come back, excuse you. Hello. Oh, I want that one banana. Yes. And some of these moments just kind of suck, because, like, it's very tense if you want to make sure you get everything. I don't want to miss anything. I'm getting it all for you. All for you. It's all for you, ladies and gentlemen. And everybody in between. All right, so we're going to keep going. We're having a good time, right? We're doing well. I'm trying to be kind of careful because I don't really pre-play these levels. I try not to because it kind of ruins it. I want to have fun and try to get everything. I at least want to make a good effort to try to get everything as close to one try as I can. I'm not perfect. You all know that. You've seen it firsthand. But I'm willing to admit it. That's half the battle sometimes, right? Being humble. There's another puzzle piece. That's an easier one to get. I believe that this level starts to get kind of tricky with... Oh! <laughs> that was not on purpose, I promise. Okay. No Dixie. No safety jump. That's gonna be boring. Boring. Why is it boring? It's gonna be bad. I don't trust my skills, unfortunately. My skills do not pay the bills. My skills probably cause people to spend extra money. Also, I love that Rambi kicks out its back feet for enemies. I did not know it did that. That's amazing. Good on Rambi. See, Rambi, what a bro. What a bro Rambi is. And you can smack him right on his butt, speed away, and he just, he just goes with it, you know? What a guy. I'm pretty sure there's nothing to be done over on this side. I don't think there's like any special bonuses things, but you gotta go quick here. Remember speed being of the essence. Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh, boy. That was not my finest moment, but I am racking up a ton of lives. So that's good. I also guess part of it's like, you know, if I beat everything in one, one try, like this series would be a little bit shorter. I don't really want that to happen. It's not, you know, it's not really ideal just to power through everything. I think this is a puzzle piece or something. Yeah, 
Okay, good. So I did remember that. This is just for my time previously playing. Like I said, I don't pre-play anything or I try not to. Oh boy. No, Rib, no! Okay, we made it. Oh no! Oh no! Those were very real reactions. Oh my gosh, this is... Oh, I got all those. That's a puzzle piece too. Alright, we got one more that we need. I don't know what, I don't know where it is though. I'm nervous. Guys, I'm nervous. They stacked those. Oh, it's right there. I was not expecting that to be there. They stacked all those really close together. All right, and then there's a little hidden drop down door. Oh boy, this is gonna kill me. Oh, I'm making some very questionable sounds in this lep in this episode, so I apologize, ladies and gentlemen, if that makes you uncomfortable, because I am also uncomfortable. But I'm doing my best. Hopefully that's good enough for you. What's the point if you can't just do your best? All right, so here we go. Oh, no, 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 Remy, no. Yeah, it's kind of hard to to judge how the momentum is gonna go when you're running through with, oh, what? Okay, that was not on purpose. I have no idea how that happened. Oh my gosh, that was just a disaster. A disaster, but it's okay, because Remy's back. Remy felt bad for us, and he decided to make himself front and center because we he knows we need his help oh boy <laughs> that would actually would have been pretty great if i would have missed right there so with the rambi blocks you don't smash them unless you hit them with his horn so or maybe i don't know maybe his back feet i don't know if that counts but it's kind of hard to to get the moment oh boy i want this please please just i just okay. hold on can I? okay this is a, an exhibition of failure. This is great. Hopefully someday, if I ever become... Oh! <laughs> if I ever become a professional YouTuber, God willing, and uh, goddess willing, whoever's out there, I'm hoping that there are just ultimate amounts of fail compilations made on my behalf. Because you know that I've got plenty of content. It's out there, ladies and gentlemen. Just carpe diem with my failure. Seize that day. I'll think of you fondly if you pull it off. All right. Come on. Ugh. Didn't give it to me. Ugh, I, I just gotta be patient. I just, I get, I get a little anxious and stressed out when stuff is all crumbly bumbly. I don't have Dixie to bail me out, so I can't do the double jump, so I basically have to do it the normal way. Also, I keep thinking every time that I jump off that platform that I'm doomed, but there's like just enough space for Rambi to make it. At least I'm not backtracking, so that's good, you know? I haven't gotten that the G yet. I haven't been a G yet, so. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can wait. All right, come here. Come here, guy. Oh, I guess I didn't need it. Oh, oof, I made it. See? Stuck it out for you guys. How about that? Everybody likes that. Everybody likes that. Oof, we made it. Alright, let's hit this barrel with Rambi. Does it come after the banana coin? Yes. Alright, just bananas. Lame, but you know, it is what it is. All the Kong letters. All the puzzle pieces. Oh yeah. That feels good. And I'm not entirely sure I'm going to pace out these episodes, but, you know, that felt pretty good. Two levels, especially with the amount of times that I goofed. So I think next time, we'll take on 2-3 the horn, top bop. Thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze, and I'll see you next time. Bye.